Good evening, I'm meteorologist Karen Williams, and we started out with a few sprinkles today, but the one good thing is we're beginning to have a mild trend that will be moving in for the week, and things are going to be feeling almost seasonable again. Looking at that out-the-door forecast, it's shaping up like this for your Sunday. We'll have broken skies, 54 degrees, and it'll be a combination of clouds and sun on Sunday, 58 degrees, and then we'll continue that trend into the evening, 57 degrees by 7 p.m. Now, looking at our radar from earlier today, you can see there are just, just a few light, consistently light showers that moved in on the coast here, pretty much the heaviest of which were in between Eureka and Redway. Those are the areas that look like had the heavier marine type showers. And there's also a few showers down to our south in Laytonville and Fort Bragg and also to the mountain regions as well. Now, as we look at our future tracker, we're gonna put that into motion. And as we put it into motion here, not a whole lot of activity. We'll start to dry out and notice the winds will shift from the north and it'll be coming in off of the coastal region here. So that's gonna give us the marine layer of clouds that we can expect. And that's gonna keep those temperatures down just a little bit. And then finally, eventually we'll start to warm up just a little bit. Most of the showers will stay up to our north and another view of your future tracker. Again, that's that low pressure from today. That'll be out of here by Sunday. We have another line that'll be moving in. It will be a little bit of a warm front, but that's going up towards Oregon. And then we have another little cool line that's going to be moving through. It may spark one or two showers, but not everyone's going to see it. And then once that happens, things will dry out and we'll start to see more sunshine toward the week. Again, for our week ahead, we expect it to be a dry one as we wait for that warming trend to move in. High temperatures for tomorrow will be in the mid 60s. And as you go inland, those temperatures will be in the upper 70s with Wairika at 77 degrees, 78 for Willow Creek. And as we travel down to the south, it'll be 75 in Laytonville and in the 80s as you move toward the east. Reading at 85. Now looking at your marine forecast, we'll have south winds 5 to 15 knots, waves west 5 feet every 9 seconds. We will keep a chance for showers and then for tomorrow, we're looking at northwest winds 5 to 10 knots, waves west 5 feet every 8 seconds. There's your sunrise time and your high tide and low tide times. Looking at your forecast for tonight, we'll have mostly cloudy skies. We'll have that isolated shower possible, 53 degrees. And then for tomorrow, we'll have more clouds than sun, 59 degrees. And then for your coastal seven day forecast, we're looking at broken clouds Monday, highs in the upper 50s. We'll still keep those clouds around for Monday. And then for Tuesday through the rest of the week, we'll have plenty of sunshine. We'll have temperatures to move up in the upper 50s to low 60s. And then for your inland forecast, we're looking at mostly sunny skies, temperatures in the upper 60s. By midweek, temperatures will move up to the mid 70s and then 80s by the weekend.